good morning. Having my coffee. It has been checked for wasps. For sooner. We do not want another incident like uh, the one yesterday. Uh, that, uh, that is not something I would like to experience again. <laughs> um, if yesterday I found a wasp in my coffee with my mouth and like I like animals and stuff but I I don't like them that much <laughs> I'm a little bit low I think it's better I think so um, all right so uh, yesterday we uh, <coughs> we uh, graduated like I think we graduated two sims from university and the rest got expelled <laughs> there was a lot of expelled sims and uh, one of them was Cornelius Goth he was in fourth year he got expelled and today he is moving back to his childhood home where he grew up uh, he is the sole heir of this mansion and Lucy here has been like house sitting um, because she was married to <laughs> she was married to Alexander Goth when when Cornelius went to university. Um, Alexander met the same fate as everybody else. Uh, he uh, he got scared by ghosts and died, so he is now dead. And we have, um, yeah. So the family tree is a little bit um, sad, um, but we do have like. So both Cassandra and Alexander is dead, but we do have a lot of grandkids for uh, for Mortimer, who is also dead, of course. <laughs> and uh, the heir of the mansion, as I said, is Cornelius because he was born first. So, and like by Cassandra because she was the older one. So. Uh, that's just how it's going to be like Diana might have like some claim to the estate but she doesn't want to be here she she thinks that the place is a bit creepy <laughs> even though she adopted Cassandra's iconic hairstyle for herself so i think what we're going to do like there's no money here now uh, because all of Cornelius' money is in his bank account, and he has a uh, he has a debt to settle too. We I'm looking for the loan jar. This house is in a sorry state, so uh, Cornelius is not going to be too happy to see this, and he's getting home very early. So I think what he's going to do is that he's going to go inside and uh, like see all this. So the butler is there as well. <laughs> like, and he, he came here with his, um, in his uh, um, sporting gear. I don't understand why. This is the style that he chose for himself. This is what he aged up into. And I think, oops, um, I think I cannot handle my camera today. I think this is uh, fantastic. I, I think that this is uh, so suiting to uh, yeah <laughs> to the air of what do you do? Oh, that's his outer clothes. Well, I'm gonna put them as his inner clothes because I, I don't this will not do. Alright, he doesn't like it. He doesn't like the dog. <laughs> Uh, I don't remember who got the dog, but I don't think it was Cornelius. So I think the dog has got to go as well. So can in this game, can we wake people up? No, we cannot. But we can go here. Oh, that's the wrong sim. And uh, give them a piece of our mind. Because like you were supposed to take care of the house 
Not trash it. What on earth have you done? So, um, okay. So now he, he wakes them up if I can. There. That's Cornelius waking them up. <laughs> okay, it's half past four in the morning and he is pissed. <laughs> but he's gonna plan outfit uh, because I don't want him in that, those clothes. And I, yeah, we can do, we can do this. That's fantastic. So that's gonna be his outdoor clothes and his indoor clothes. That's fine. Uh, by me. Because I thought this was his indoor clothes and it's, it's gonna be his indoor clothes now. Oh, hello, I'm sure let me here again. <laughs> nice dream yesterday. I, I didn't stay the entire time because I had stuff to do, but I like what I saw. <laughs> I left my screen in my uh, tab open though. Malinka. Sorry for not telling you. <laughs> Just sort of went away from the computer. Okay, so he is going to not propose. What is happening? Oh, he can transfer a lot of ownership. We are not going to do that. We are going to... How am I mean in this game? <laughs> uh, I'm not able to be mean to her. I, I, I want to irritate her. Uh, we can argue a bit with her. About what have you done, Lucy? You're supposed to... You know, you and Alexander, the starters, and who's this Ricky person? Bolivar! Ooh! Dashta! Hello! Yeah, you don't, don't just hello me! <coughs> Ooh. Answer. Bolivar, but what have you done? The, the, the place is in a mess. What the hell? Sure, like, what the hell? <laughs> she was like, no, it's, you know, it's all fine. The butler will handle it. He will not, <laughs> because the butler is useless in this game too. <laughs> no problem with his playing. Is this the goth? Yes, this is the goths. Uh, you missed my uh, introduction. Uh, this is Cornelius Goth, and he is the heir of uh, the goth mansion. And he has been at university, and now he's gotten back because he got expelled in year four. I'm very annoyed by that. <laughs> <laughs> because uh, if you're gonna get expelled, do it sooner. Uh, anyway, so he's back to take the mansion back from Lucy, who was house sitting with Alexander. However, uh, Alexander died from a ghost because everybody dies from a ghost in this house when I play it. I have removed the outdoor furniture. Hopefully, people won't go out there and die by ghosts anymore. Um, yeah, so anyway, so uh, he, he is, um, that's why Lucy is here. Um, and Diana Goth is obviously also an heir, but she doesn't want to live here. She, she, uh, she is also the heir of the verb house. That's not a mansion, but she is the heir there. <laughs> so, so she is like, I'm, I'm going to move there <laughs> as soon as I can. So I don't really know where uh, where I'm going to put people now, but these people, I think they're just going to move out as they are. Possibly moving back to the burb house, because, but I'm going to check their money first. Um, because we need to know what they can afford. Because, oh, 15,000. That's not a lot. And I'm also unsure how to do this. <laughs> because uh, when people move out of university, I have this uh, mod that lets you decide how much money they take. But when you move out of a lot, that doesn't really work. So... I could move them into an apartment, um, but or or I could cheat it. 
they are the Cormier family, so they they should be a, they should have a unique name so I can use the family funds. I'm, I think I'm gonna do that. <laughs> okay, so hello, uh, withdraw. So she can just uh, withdraw. Let's do fifteen thousand. It's easier to remember. Can I not take fifteen thousand? No, I can only take ten thousand and then five five thousand more. That's annoying. Withdraw five thousand. Does wait? Does Ricky have money too? He does not. <laughs> not not anything to mention. So. Because um, they don't, they, according to the rules that I have set up, you need 20,000 to buy an empty lot. And if you can afford uh, a, um, a house plus 5,000, then you can buy that. But I don't think we have houses that cheap in this game. So I think they need to move to an apartment anyways. And I don't know if they ha if I have any good apartments left because I filled them up. <laughs> <laughs> My stream keeps stopping. I'm going to move and reboot. Okay. See you soon. Um, not as good day. So, wait. How do I do this? Is it on the computer? I find own place. Okay. Suddenly, I've forgotten all about how to play The Sims 2. Um, and The Sims 4 information keeps creeping in and replacing things and it's very confusing now what are you doing um, with your life he's unemployed he has quite a lot of money in the bank so I'm not sure he needs to have a job at all uh, he has a uh, 115,000 simoleons. That's quite a lot. That should be sufficient for anything. Hang on! We can't just move them out like without thinking. <laughs> we need to check like if... Uh, I don't know whose flowers these are. We need to check this. This You should, you should keep that. Wait, okay. Um, if any of these like toys or anything belongs to the children, I don't think so. We could, we could let them, why is there two toy boxes in this room? That should probably mean we take one of them. Um, also it's interesting to, to have a, I'm thinking that maybe we we take a lot of the kids stuff because Cornelius isn't even close to having children. So like he would be like what what is all this kids stuff doing here? Meanwhile, Lucy and Ricky like okay, they don't actually need that because I don't think it, Lucy doesn't want kids. Uh Ricky doesn't want kids. But they are they are very interested in uh, the act of um, almost making kids, <laughs> so so there might be some kids. Um, so I'm thinking like uh, they they could use this stuff, um, maybe. But we don't want the house cluttered with it while we're trying to court some woman or something. How many of these do we have? I'm gonna sell all the duplicates. Uh, apparently I've put a lot of them all over the place. So, and th there's a TV. Did Lucy and the gang buy this TV? Because I'm not sure it's very goth to have a TV and this couch. This couch does not belong here at all. So they they will need to take that. Um, maybe maybe they maybe they take the TV actually. Um, I don't know 
if they're entitled to the TV, but they go they are going to take it. This is annoying. <laughs> so when they move out, they're gonna take some random number uh, with them. No, I can just say that we should have 980. We, we're gonna note that. I, I just, okay, this makes sense in my head. Okay, 980 simoleons. This is the number that I need to remember. There we go. And they are going to have 15,000 simoleons. All right, okay. So is there any more stuff? Okay, uh, when you bring a date home, you sh this, this is probably not what she wants to see. <laughs> Um, I think, like, it, it would look kind of weird. Like, do you have kids? No. <laughs> Why do you have a, a crib next to your bed? You know, just in case. No, that's, that, that will scare her off. <laughs> well, I don't know. It, it, it looks kind of weird. Okay, and they're taking the dog, so they should take all the dog stuff. Do they have a lot of dog stuff? I don't think so. Um, this is probably theirs. I don't know. Because it's outside. Um, there's a picture of Lilith before she died. But she's back now. <laughs> uh, that house is cluttered without any kids. Yeah, and I actually added another... Well... I added another kid's room here. Uh, we don't have to bother with that. I, this one. We can't delete this object. Well, that's annoying. And I don't know how his paintings everything is, but that's fine. Yeah, so there has, there has been a lot of kids in this house. And I had to replace the stairs, I, I do believe, because... Uh, if you have, I think I did. I don't know. Um, right, so you need to have these connecting stairs. Uh, because if you have these staircases, which is here from the start, then only one sim can be on the stair at a time. And when there's a lot of kids and stuff, then... Then uh, the, the nannies and the butlers and everything, they can't get to the kids up here and they can't get the kids down to feed them and they starve to death and the social work comes and it's a whole ordeal. <laughs> oh, my god, some secret room with the TV and the computer, like you said, it's not very gothy. No, <laughs> I like to keep it authentic. <laughs> What if the date is a family sim though? Yeah, but even if you are a sim, like a family orientated person, like imagine you meet someone, and you get home to them, and they already have a crib. Like, isn't that, <laughs> isn't that weird? <laughs> Rain through the roof. There is. I don't know. I I think I have. Oh, th there's probably rain down here, like over the staircase. But I think I've covered all of it, I think. I don't know. So, so I, I, w I would be a kind of creeped out like, uh, uh, by that. Even though I wanted kids, I would be like, this is our first date. <laughs> like, what is the crib doing here? And like not just stashed away in the attic, like right there in the bedroom. Um, yeah, I would think that was weird. Anyway, okay, I, I think I've gotten everything now. And if they missed something, they missed something. Uh, they're gonna lose the paintings. So she's bringing the dog, obviously, and Ricky and Diana. And, and also Gunther, I forgot about him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh so that's going to leave only only Cornelius here. 
and Dag we, dag. Uh, we're gonna go to uh, neighborhood view to see that I get the money correctly. But meanwhile, while they are leaving, and he's like, "Yeah, you better leave. You you did not take care of my house to my liking." <laughs> She's all happy. <laughs> see, he's angry. Uh, now he wants to be friends with Ricky, but he doesn't want to have a party. But he we can't have a party. We we need to clean up first. This is awful. So you you need to clean this up, for instance. She Ah, Vabi. Evelyn. Yeah. Suppose. Oh, you, you're holding a book. Then maybe you put that away first. What are you doing? <laughs> oh dear. Put away all books. Diana is very pretty, though. Uh, she is the daughter of, like, obviously Lucy and Alexander Goth, and. I really like her. And she grew up into these pony ponytails. Uh, and I thought that was hilarious since they're living in the golf mansion and everything. But not anymore. Okay. There. Finally alone. <laughs> See, now they didn't take everything. Uh, Okay, l so let's let's just give them these remaining two thousand. They're gonna that will make them have two hundred more than they should have, but I think that's fine. Um, so that will be easy for all of us. Yeah, there. <laughs> Genetic ponytails. <laughs> Probably yes. <laughs> I don't know if there is any coding in the game that does that, but it would be interesting. So now these are the Cormier family, and we are supposed to give them two thousand family funds. I don't think there are another family, but we will find out with this name. If I that did it, it did, yes. Now, I don't like to keep them in the same bit. <laughs> 200 interest. Yeah, I, I was almost contemplating them having to give uh, Cornelius this 2000 because he didn't like what they had done to the place. <laughs> so now. There's 90,000 here, so there should be 92,000. Um, no, I, I mean 80, 88. Oh, should be minus there. And we should. Do we have other golfs? I don't think so. Oh. Let's see. Yeah, that worked too. Great. Now, what are we going to do with these people? <laughs> uh, I don't think there's a house that they can... They can afford this house. Uh, the, the house market is not great in my game. Let's see what is going on over in Blue Water. They, they can afford that little trailer. Not awesome. There's a lot of empty houses here, I think. No, there's not. This they can barely afford, and then they won't have any money to buy furniture, so we don't do that. We could move them in there. That's nicer. And it's not a trailer, so I think, like, uh, it's a little bit on the pricey side according to the rules, but maybe we allow it because. I just don't want them to uh, Yeah, I don't I have no idea what the end of that sentence was supposed to be. <laughs> that got away from me. 
this house though, it's really, really small. But we, we can utilize some... Uh, maybe they sell that TV though. I don't know. There is just one bedroom. But we have some hacked beds that we can use to make... Uh... Now let's see. I think it's this one. It's a shelf single bed. It's suitable for caravans. They Now they are not in a caravan, but we could use that anyway. Let's put that there. The cell doesn't have them a nice double bed. Uh, the cheapest kind. I think they, they uh, need to like try and save some money. I don't know if they have jobs at all. I don't think so. Well, he is a test subject. Fantastic. Bright expectation from him. <laughs> so we got one of those beds. And we should have another one. Um, I just need to... Wait. That's not how you do it. You do it like this. And we do level. And we do mid. Because I think high is too high. This is from uh, SimLogical, by the way. Uh, I think high usually puts them in the ceiling. No, that's fine. That is fine. Uh, so now I can get another one. Which is down here. Can't intersect other objects. That's the whole point. <laughs> Do I put need to put it with the move object on? Maybe. Yes. But I want another bedding. Wait, what are they wearing? Okay, so this can be. Uh, Diana's bed and Gunther, he is wearing all brown, so maybe he wants some brown bedding. <laughs> Where is it? There it is. Um, this is sort of matching. So that's nice. There we go. They, they can um, they can sleep there. It's awful. But they don't have much uh, and I, but I don't, I don't think uh, these people would sell the TV. It's like, no, I, I like the TV. They have a lot of coupons for free meals, though. That's interesting. Let's put the teddy out here, and this toy. Wait, it should be okay. And this, we don't need to have this out because we don't have toddlers at the moment but we do have this sofa should we have the tv over there that's weird I, I i don't know i'm just i'm not supposed to play this family right now i just realized <laughs> i was playing the gods uh, i just want to put their stuff here all right uh let's put some flowers and let's I don't think they have a loan jar, which is kind of weird. They have a magic lamp, though. Diana has a magic lamp that she found at some point. So, and I'm contemplating if we are supposed to put that out because otherwise they don't seem to get wishes for it. Uh, that one you can oh my goodness why have you why have you gotten this it's nice I guess and this is a little dragon that we're, we're supposed to have somewhere I don't know why do you have it I think she got and bought it in a store that I was playing all right Wait, can children play with those bricks thingies? It's kind of funny. I'm going to put it out there. It's an outside toy. There you go. Uh, they have a phone. They do not have a computer. And maybe they don't need one. I don't know. Uh... 
Uh, my OCD is telling me I have to... I don't have OCD, I'm sorry. <laughs> I have to fix the day and stuff. There. Starting my game so I can play and watch you play the golf. That is multitasking. Yeah, uh, second, second monitor content, right? <laughs> you gotta have that. Uh, let's see. It should be Monday in winter with th three days left. We should set... It's already Monday. Um, and we should set... Season 3. Season length. Three days. There we go. Now it is all correct. There. And I'm gonna mark these as Cormier family. And what I do, like I have all these uh, colors in my <laughs> in my spreadsheet, um, and I can't decide what color they should be. So there's like twelve options here, including black and white. So I just go to random.org and randomize. <laughs> Yay for tablets with Twitch on. Oh yeah, that's awesome. <clears throat> I usually use my phone yes, because I, I, uh, I mostly just listen to people. Okay, so we got number two apparently, uh, which is uh, dark red. But then I also go and I do seven... And we got number four, so then it's one, two, three, four, so it's that kind of red. And now the text isn't showing so well, so I'm gonna make it white. There we go, that's how I decide what color they should have. <laughs> how, how are you doing today? I hope you're doing well. Well, hi Gifto Gabby, I am doing good. I uh, hope you're doing well too. I just got confused um i'm always a little bit confused i feel like okay yeah so i think i'm done with this family now i, I got got them settled everyone has potentially a bed i haven't designed the beds but we'll do that in gameplay later i also need them to have a number so I'm just gonna randomize that to... It's just for order sake. Like, okay, so we get 87. I don't know if another family has that. It doesn't matter. Uh, I'm just gonna put the... Oh, not like that. I'm just gonna put that there. So now when I auto sort this uh, spreadsheet, they're gonna get down here <laughs> in order. Uh, and I play them when I get to them. Oh, and also, no, I did this wrong. <laughs> I accidentally put Ricky as, he, as if he was nearly and the vice versa. That was not good. Okay. So, sort again. There we go. What was I thinking? I, there was there was a thought that got away from me. There's a lot of that in my head. It's 2.30 a.m. and I can't sleep. Yeah, it happens. <laughs> Hopefully I, I start being boring soon so you can fall asleep. <laughs> okay, so now they are over here being the Cormiers. I don't know how to say that. Is it Cormier or Cormier? Or what is it? what is it? <laughs> That's them, anyways. Oh, right now I forget, now I remember what I was going to do. So they are actually here. We have a token for each sim um, that they pass down in the generations, and this means that uh, this family is also being recorded because Diana has the recorded token. So. Uh, yeah, I might have to change the order, but depending on how much I play on camera <laughs> during the week. Um, all right, but now we're back in the golf household. That only took me forty minutes. 
<laughs> I'm always so surprised uh, at how long it, that fixing stuff up is uh, compared to the gameplay. So here's uh, Cornelius, uh, really happy that th those people are gone. Didn't I tell you to put away all the now he has two deeds here it seems put up and this deed hereby proclaims that Cornelius Goth is the proud owner of 250 Main Street which is valued at 132,000 simoleons that's nice and this deed hereby proclaims that Cornelius Goth is the proud owner of 290 Main Street which is valued at 91 thousand symbols okay so after he i think he wants to have like a coming home party but we need to fix the house up this will not do we will have to like get everything away um, i like that there's an option to lick plates clean <laughs> it's very who does that when they have been sitting out like right after you eat yeah but when it's someone else's plate and it's been sitting out how disgusting do you have to be <laughs> to lick it clean yeah. <laughs> oh, oh i'm sorry but you you have to clean like if you're gonna have a party you're gonna trash the house yourself you know what, i'm gonna sell these stuff and i saw that too i mean the butler will try and clean this up we, we could help him a bit so that we can have the party for hey, us they? Oh, 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 oh my goodness this is not what it should be around here we need to fix this up I won't bother with the dead leaves. That the butler and the gardener can fix that. I think we have a gardener. I'm pretty sure. You should have all the if you're this rich, you should have all the help that you can have. And I think he needs to like extract um we should have a thousand simoleons more in the household funds in case it's not enough for the butler we don't want to stiff the butler when doing good job That's good weed pulling there oh he's uh, automatically doing that okay don't do that but here i don't understand these little gardens why is there a fence around them <laughs> i don't i don't understand is it because you don't you can lock it so that dogs don't get in there like what what is it yeah we do have a gardener she can she can manage all that i hope but, you know, clean this up mop this up oh my goodness should we like we have two music and dance Why magazines we don't need that we can like take one of them and put in here somewhere so that if someone uh, thinks it's nice we can read it we need a little table here oops how did i put that that was good did i put it on the wall that's weird This is nice. I kinda want it next to the chair, but there's a lamp there also. Is, is this dumb? I don't, know. <laughs> I don't know how to put things. I wanna alt place them. Okay, well I'm gonna I'm gonna let Boom. it be like that. Hey, okay. That's oh, fine. I 
I'm not sure if I accidentally installed a mod that makes ACR actions less chaotic. But I I might have done and I might not like that. Because I feel like uh, parties and everything is not as chaotic as they used to be. People are not getting upset with each other as they used to be. I don't know. Okay, yeah, you can you can stop that. Well, nobody's gonna see the leaves anyway. There, there's no. <laughs> okay, and we are getting our bills. What are the bills situation like in this, in this house? Get those. Uh -huh. So much to do in this house. Ah, whatever. Uh, 2,488. All right. Okay, should we say hi to Dagmar? I don't know. I'm, I'm gonna do it. Do for ah, now. Madame. now, he has a little crush on Carol Clark, it seems. Who is he attracted to? Not her. <laughs> I think he, she tried to get with him. I don't think Cornelius is interested. Uh, what would the... Where, where is the adjuster? Adjust... Ro casual romance, sims adjuster, it's this plant over here that looks totally different. <laughs> Show my token stats. So, he is bi and he has a... Uh, he has the hots for Carol Clark at the moment, but I don't. I am. Um, I don't know um, about that. But okay, so the house is in pretty good. Oh, not that. Okay. What is wrong with that place? You're not allowed to take it. Clean that up, and then you can throw a party like a uh, house party. Someone have a party. I find it also very funny that there are still bees while it's snowing. That's weird. <laughs> Down here I, I see bees. Like what are they doing here? Bee. Bees, you should like hibernate. It's snowing. Come on. Oh I love winter in this game. It's it's so wintry. Okay, so I'm just gonna go like this. Okay, wait. The most attractive person in the entire village is apparently Marisa Bendit, so we are going to invite her. But then we are also going to invite Carol, because why wouldn't he? Uh, Benjamin Burb, Darren Dreamer, yeah, he played a, a big role in Cornelius' upbringing, so we're going to invite them and Lakshmi, sure, Marsha, sure, David, Lilith, yes, <laughs> it's gonna be weird, it's kind of weird, she came back from the dead, <laughs> and it, she, yeah, she's here now, uh, Brooke and Dustin, Katharina is not allowed to come because we have our 12 guests now. Sorry, uh, Katarina. Mm. <laughs> I always feel like the, the first person that I don't invite. I, oh, I feel like the level they two, oh, level just didn't make the cut, you know. Okay, all oh, right. Do we have... Yes, we do. Okay, so what is his lifetime wish? He wants to beca become a Hall of Famer. I don't... I don't I don't really feel it, you know? What is his interests? He likes culture and fashion and entertainment. Uh, well, he kind of likes sports. Um, I don't know.
if I should let him keep that because he has the he does have that maybe we ignore his lifetime wish because he, he has the, the lot to take care of so we should uh, we should do that wait it's the sim blender yeah I'm just gonna try and re-roll it I have a mod install with a lot like 50 other lifetime wishes which could be more fun um actually i feel this way more but i still don't want him to have a career uh a career goal um well i'm gonna okay we re-roll it until we get a non-career goal that's the rule that I just made up. Uh, this is show business career. It so makes sense, but I want him to have a non-career goal. <laughs> Celebrity chef. Reach maximum long-term long aspiration. Oh, he's got quite a way to go there. <laughs> well, that's good. Uh, your dream is to live a life to its fullest. Keep your spirits high as often as you can by doing what you really want and achieving your goals. And watch your lifetime aspiration meter go up. It can be found right beside the regular aspiration bar. Yeah, it's this one. This is the lifetime aspiration meter. I hardly ever watch it. But you can, you can see how many rewards they have earned by looking at it. Um... To boost it further, pass the life milestones of a well-rounded person. Grow up, have first kiss, first woohoo, graduate from college. Oh, we missed that. <laughs> Fall in love, marry, have a child or adopt, maximize hobby, career and business. You might also take genie's health and wish for peace of mind. This one doesn't give a custom memory. There is the original one. Okay. So. So that is one from that mod I installed. And I really like that. Because now we can just focus on his wants. And he really wants this party to be awesome. So huh? we are going to focus on that. Say for my... ah. Let's see if he actually wants to get married. Like, he, he needs an heir at some point, but he can, like, if he gets old, uh, well, if he dies, that's going to be a problem, but we're just going to transfer the money to someone. Uh, or, yeah, something. Oh, right. He has a lot of money, <laughs> doesn't he? <laughs> yes, he does. So we are going to make sure... Uh, we, he has 121,100. Ah, okay, wrong window. Go away, chat. There, I'm going to update that because I haven't. 121,100. Kind of good. Oh, right, he has a loan as well. I forgot about that. We need to settle that. Also, all oh, right, now that we know his... I'm sorry, I'm all over the place. Uh, this is probably good for that lifetime want. However, having these wants or these uh, makes it gives you more time to actually fulfill your your wants. But is this better? Uh, he has pretty good stuff. So why would you want to lower the social need when you're a popularity sim? That is. Highly illogical. We're, we're gonna do that. Okay. We have a loan jar that we are going to put somewhere. Oh, there is a loan jar. I hope there's not a loan attached to it because that would be uh, a problem. But there was not, so that's fine. Because this belongs to Lucy. But she didn't have a loan, so it's fine. Uh, because they had money in the bank. So we can uh, check the loan 
that is 9,500. Uh, and loan should be 5%, but he can just go up here and withdraw 10,000 and just settle it. Because he has money. And then... <laughs> And then, um, oh, that's a nice number. Now he has 111,100 on the bank deposit account. I want to deposit 11 uh, simoleons to that. <laughs> that would be cool. Uh, pay back entire loan. There you go. Now he has zero in loan and one, 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 zero, so zero monies. Fantastic. And now he's allowed to party. <laughs> so, okay. Benjamin, why are you wearing a backpack? Um, can I say hello to you? Bye. Oh, chat. Ha, the Lord. Um, but, 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 we need to have his will in order. I seem to have made a will previously. I don't know how often I should do this. I usually go on, I look at family and I then I put if if he doesn't have um, any relationship with them I, I, I don't maybe put them in. I don't know. And then I usually put the number here. Th there's a whole thing that I haven't really decided yet. So so uh, let's just uh, like we don't we never know who is going to die. So I'm gonna take some screenshots. Yes, <laughs> I know. Uh, and then we go in friends category as well. Um, there. So if he dies, I can sort this out afterwards. But I usually go on the lifetime. What is it called? Um, yeah, the, the, the slow bar down there. Use that to decide who gets money and who doesn't. And I only do that for like extremely wealthy things. Ah. Like the ones that... Um, uh, I, have, like, I think it's more than 50,000 in the bank. Uh, give their money to either their household or you know the closest relative. Some something. <laughs> All right, and Marissa Wait, is she actually in prison wearing those clothes? <laughs> yeah, I think she's in prison. Uh, Marissa. Yeah, she should not be here. Well, let's just pretend she is like out on some sort of leave of some sort. Let's yeah, talk what? to her. How do we make this party awesome? Should we like serve some food? We should say hi to Lilith too. What? We could give her a hug. Yeah. she wants to do that? I don't know. Maybe we talk to her first. Just don't go up to people and kiss them. Oh, and Lilith, uh, she is pregnant. She's <laughs> talking to Brooklyn here about <laughs> babies and such. So oh, Brooklyn has yeah. 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 Oh, she's trying to get back to her daughter's grandmother. She and uh, Skip Jewel. 
get sorted. <laughs> 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 Service food normally. Uh, I don't know where the butler went. Did he go home? I don't know. <laughs> oh, I just realized this. Is a sounds too loud, by the way. Uh, I'm gonna lower it slightly because it looks like it might be too loud. Uh, I didn't do a ch sound shake like I should have done. I, think, but I want my voice to be uh, be heard like at all. Uh, is this too loud? I don't know. I have no idea. <laughs> also, I would like the sound from the game to keep playing well when I uh, when the window loses focus, but I have no idea how to do that. Okay, uh, we are going to scrap all the painting stuff. Because uh, Cornelius can't uh, complete them. Uh, someone is calling to. Alright. Oh, you answered the phone there. <laughs> She's like, why didn't you invite me to the party? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, Katerina. You, 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 I, I was only allowed to invite 12 guests and I didn't like you enough. <laughs> is, is the sound okay now? That's great. Because I can see in the audio mixer that my voice should be heard now over the, the game sounds, uh, but it's... I only have a visual representation of that. I have no idea. Yeah, scrap all the paintings. The party is uh, going well. Didn't we have another painting? There is now the painting. Scrap that too. That way, if you feel like painting later, you can. <laughs> I think, like, if someone started this painting and we have them over, they might, uh, they might finish it, but uh, they might not. Yeah, apparently he needs some tea. Really badly. We better do that. Oh, people are dancing. Yeah. It's, it's fine that they dance a little bit. Like, but people smuffle a lot. And I don't think it, it, it uh, actually makes a good party. You need to stop them from doing this. <laughs> Otherwise, everyone's going to go home and be bored. I, it's so weird. Well, Dustin, you don't seem to have a good time. I'm gonna talk to... Oh, oh well, drag Dustin, I guess, because I accidentally clicked that button. So, yeah. He also wants to pull a prank, uh, influence someone to entertain another sim, have a pillow fight, and influence someone to talk to another sim. Uh, I don't know if I want people to do stuff to other people. I mean, I could just do it randomly. Wait, where's where's the influence? There, influence to talk to Brooke, maybe. Go and talk to Brooke. Mm. 
So since uh, since Cornelius' lifetime wish is now to have a maximum long time aspiration meter, like his gameplay is going to be real, really one space. Now he wants to have a pillow fight with Marissa. So we like let's do that. Play. Where is the play? Um, play. Uh, we cannot have a pillow fight. Let's tickle her. We need to be better friends before we can have a pillow fight, it seems. But he's really attracted to her. I can hug her as a friend. Like, Carol, you don't have to worry. <laughs> Just going to try and be friends with this person. I'm. What am I doing? Um, I think all the music. Well, he wants to pull a prank on someone too. I think. <laughs> yeah. All right. Oh, now he wants to pull a prank on Benjamin. Okay. Well, well let's do that. Uh, if I can find the option, it's. Not easy. Okay. What is the ventrilo part? I don't know. But apparently it's fun to do. Congratulations on hosting a terrific party. Your guest had a fantastic time. Party score, good time. Well, we wanted it to be a uh, good party. Okay, that was enough, apparently. <laughs> so that's good. But now I think, like, it's 5 p.m. We need to. Oh, get alarm installed. Change owner, Cornelis. Uh, yes, we will do that. And then we will go to one of our community lots. It's gonna be nighttime, but it's, uh, it's fine. Alright, if you people would uh, move out of the way, what are you doing? Why are you standing here, Lily? Okay, thank you for moving. Get the alarm installed and yes. And now I can't click it. I wanted to queue up to go to a community lot. But we'll have to try and remember to do that when he gets back. And while he was installing the alarm, we are uh, uh, we did age up, so he is now 25, and he's still expelled, but it's now Monday. <laughs> I had I had expelled on the weekday. There. There. Um. Spreadsheet updated. The phone is ringing a lot. What are you doing? Why are you sneaking around here, Lily? Like, why? What? Are you, what did you do? Did you steal our newspaper? You don't. Ho you're not holding a newspaper. I don't know. I don't know what she did. <laughs> she was sneaky. We have our newspaper right there. I don't know. There, it is now evening time. But that's, I think that's fine. I think we can still make some money on the community lot. Actually, could you, could you, um, no. <laughs> can't he answer here? Who's calling that I can't answer on my mobile phone? Okay, answer there then. I don't understand. And then drive to community lot. Yeah. <sighs> Alexander isn't home? Lucy, no, he is not. Have you lost your marbles? <laughs> my goodness. Gee, my late husband that I replaced with another husband isn't at home? Really? <laughs> okay. So 2050 Main Street is the pool and the other one is this local business stuff. I think I'm gonna go there because I think last time I went somewhere was the pool. I'm gonna go to the other lot. 
And I think we might have an employee there. Oh dear, the butler is having issues. What is your problem? I can't fix it for you. Oh, you can't get to those? Well, I'm too... S I'm very sorry. <laughs> also, the butler stays kind of late. So, since he, I have the mod that makes townies age up, the butler age up each day I have them in some household. And I sometimes have them in uh, multiple households, so they get quite old quite fast. <laughs> That's why they keep dying. Oh, now he wants to ask him Sim on a date. I wonder what who he will ask. And he wants a customer to get a star. And hire Benjamin as a pl he wants to hire Benjamin as an employee. That's interesting. I think Benjamin ha doesn't have a, a job, but I I don't think it's good to play to get a played sim a job like this because they they don't seem to be making money. I'm not coming in today. You don't pay me enough. To feel like I'm really needed. What? Hello. How am I going to raise your wages if you don't come here? That's problematic. Uh, and also, how will I fire you if you're not here? Where is the open sign? There it is. Can I call in employees? Like, will she come anyway, even though she, she said she wouldn't? I don't know. I'm not coming in today. Okay. Well, maybe she will come in some other day. I, I don't know. Oh, she, he needs to take a shower. Uh, do we have a shower over here? No. Why would you have a shower in a, in a supermarket? But we need... Like, this is a employee area i feel like so we could we could like squeeze one in there maybe i don't know if this is gonna present any big problem but i'm going to <laughs> this is gonna be kind of weird i just need an employee shower can we in this game can we like lock doors and stuff the same as in sims 4 only maybe in this game it works there and then a little uh, wall shower would if you don't mind like this one This, this is the strangest thing I have ever seen, but he needs to take a shower. <laughs> so, yeah, excuse the mess, we're redecorating or something. All right, could I, could I lock it for allow household and employees only? There you go. Hello, Hayden. Okay. Yeah, on the carpet. That that is fantastic. Oh, he also needs to eat. Oh my goodness. Did you like not take care of yourself at all before you went here? Apparently so. And while they're clean oh no, don't lick clean. Oh my goodness, what is happening? Is it because he's so hungry? Uh but we need to clean this up. And then you can grill some hot dogs. Hopefully don't die in the process and hopefully no customer will be very upset that I um, don't serve them while I'm doing all this maybe he wanted to hire how do I do that business hire employees he wanted to hire Benjamin maybe we do that um, with this lot and we need to do that first. Okay, that's enough showering for you. I've got this water. We can't have water like this. 
Um, we can't choose... What is this? No. We can't choose, so we have to like invite him over. But we also have to ring up these customers. What price point have we set for everything? Everything is cheap. Okay. That's probably because we want more stars. How does this work? We are only in level 1. We could get... Um, you'll enjoy a starting boost to all your new relationships. That might be good. We could do this and we'll make more money per item sold. That's smart. I think I'm gonna do that one. Oh no, he's gonna starve to death while I do this. Okay, here's Benjamin. We want him to invite over. We want him to come here so I can hire him. How nice of you to invite me. I'll just gussy up and come right over. Fantastic. Uh, but when are you coming over? Well, this is The Sims 2. It's more realistic. People don't, don't just spawn on your lot uh, as soon as... <laughs> as, you, as soon as you invite them. That's not realistic. It takes them a while to walk here. Okay. So what should we have him do? Uh, hi! Okay, first, first try and hire him. Oh, that seems to be working. Don't eat that! Yeah, I know you're starving, but... You, you can have Benjamin here uh, tidy up the place. Uh, would you like to hire? Y yeah. I don't know why, but I do want it. <laughs> no wasps. Hooray. <laughs> Cinnamon, though. Okay, so now... We are going to management, um, assign, uh, tidy up, because we need this place to be tidied up. And I'm going to grill some hot dogs, because I'm starving. <laughs> Did he do it? I don't know. Maybe I have to redo that. Uh, no, I think I assigned that. So could you, could you please do the hot dogs now? Yeah, we have a customer over there. Can I quickly um, ring up? Also, it's very stupid. When you're here with some other sim, it's very annoying that there's two registers. Because you will go to one of them and the employee will not be there. <laughs> it's very annoying. So ideally we should have two cashiers, but I'm I'm not having a third one. It's that that's too much. But it doesn't make sense to remove this one. But maybe maybe we actually do. We want all the customers to come to the same place. We can add registers later. <laughs> Yeah, the hot dogs will probably be... Stop! Don't do that. Uh, yeah, you... Uh, I, I know. We should add a fridge instead. <laughs> grilling, custom, uh, grilling, well, grilling customers is not a good idea, but uh, hot dogs. <laughs> I mean hot dogs. There, uh, but then, okay. Why am I not al allowed to? Okay, I don't know. Now there's a fire. 
that will not give us uh, any any stars. And I'm not trying to kill him, but it, mm. okay, this is not going well at all. If he dies, I'm not saving. <laughs> Could you could you call the emergency, please? Maybe we actually distinguished. No, we did not. Fire station, come here quickly. It's there's a fire and I'm starving to death. Can you help me? Don't do that. Okay. Now we gotta get fine because there's no fire. Oh, there is a fire. Thank you for helping. Okay, and then now maybe we can get these hot dogs and eat them even though they're burned to a crisp. <laughs> because we don't want him to die. Oh dear. Gotta run, please be more careful next time. Oh yeah, I'm, tr I'm, I'm gonna try. We'll, we'll see. I'm not good at multitasking. <laughs> okay, why don't why do you have to serve the the hot dogs? Stop stop serving. Just eat the hot dog before you die. Goodness. Also, now that things are a bit tidier, I could assign Benjamin as a cashier and we'll have that sorted. Oh, this Dora person, she went in the retirement home that I'm playing, she, uh, she went and extracted all her money because she's gonna die next time the clock strikes 6pm, but she's still alive, she walks around talking to people, So, but I, I see her as dead, <laughs> she's like a dead person walking, <laughs> she's very old. Okay, okay, nobody died, but now he, he needs to shower again, so, right? You can do that. There, we sorted this lot uh, a bit. I'm gonna save now, because every, no, one in, no one is about to die and I, d I don't I don't want Cornelius to die like even if that would happen in the game uh, like he's the heir and everything and he's his Don Lothario's firstborn son I, I, can't, I just can't before he has children <laughs> he, has to, he has to spawn an offspring then he can die <laughs> I don't know keep the bloodline going I guess All right, now he wants to play with his employee. Okay, uh, do that then. But they can have a pillow fight. Yep, that was, I, I didn't buy a really good shower, did I? I bought the cheapest one, which was kind of weird. Why would you do that? You have a lot of money. Play uh, pillow fight. <laughs> what is wrong with you? I'm trying to fulfill your every wish. He wants to make a bit best friends forever too. Who would we do that with? Uh, did he fall? No. Okay. He wants to be best friends forever with someone. Uh, it might as well be Carol. I don't know. It's probably the easiest, but. Oh, oh, it's in the middle of the night. He should sleep. Oh, hello. I'm trying to have a little play here with my employee. It's very important that we keep morale high. He's wearing the same clothes as me. I don't like it. Well, maybe that's the uniform. <laughs> maybe that's why he wanted to hire him. Alright. 
make a sale to Dora. Well, okay. Uh, any sale? So, like, we can show item to Dora. Stop playing. Look, we have lots and lots of games. You should buy one. Oh, I don't have any money. Why are you here? How can you have no money? Your household, I happen to know for a fact, has a lot of money, so you should, you should be able to buy my stuff. Uh, is it because we don't like her enough? Or she doesn't like me enough? Probably. Oh, hello, Daddy. Great job, Lothario. <laughs> um, uh, I should be going home, but things have started happening. Uh, yeah, do do sell to him then. There we go. Fantastic. Okay. Uh, but now, can we make her even buy something for? No. No, we are just closing the business and then we're going home. I don't... Oh, she has actually something she needs to pay for. Okay. Let's see how Benjamin does. He probably hasn't got any badges. Or anything. Yeah, he... What is this thing that I'm trying to operate? Oh, you're doing good, Benjamin. It's fine. What are you doing? Right. Looks like he was trying to play kickyball with someone, but they left. <laughs> Probably because it's six o'clock in the morning. So I think... Uh, did you close the business? Yes, you did. So I think I'm going to get him home, uh, drive home, because I don't think there's ma more customers to charge. Nope, we're going home. Oh my goodness, all of this just spoiled. And then I'm going to end the stream because I don't have much time today. Uh, we need to do a lot of stuff. I'm going to be riding this afternoon. That's going to be very, very fun. <laughs> and Cornelius is about to die from exhaustion. Thankfully, that's not a thing. You just collapse. <laughs> and it turned day again. And I do have the uh, community time mod, so he should not be uh, in the home lot for the entirety of the night. So we're just gonna speed through until it's the next day and then. Uh, then we can end the stream. But I, I don't like to um, see there's going to be 11 hours before he's here again. Uh, and this box over here, that doesn't appear if I load out of the lot and then uh, load it again, then we can't see this. So I don't like coming, coming into a lot and not knowing when they are <laughs> getting back. So that's why I'm just going to speed through before I uh, exit the lot. But it's not, it's not very fun, is it? <laughs> well, I don't think anything is going to happen. Well, we can fix this. Uh, yeah, build a reminder. Because uh, the butler can't get to that, um, that weed over there. So I'm just going to reroute the, uh, the fence a little bit so that he can. Uh, that looks kind of weird, but I'm going to have it like that. You can't stop me. I'm gonna do like this too, and I'm gonna... Oh, that's not the button I wanted to press. Um... Eh. I'm gonna remove this. And also that rose bush has to go. Because when it, it gets messy... The butler can't get to it. Same in this corner. Because it's 
This is The Sims 2 and they can't walk diagonally through things. So we're just gonna have the fence be looking like this and not have any troubles. And I think... I don't know why it's built like this actually. Why can't we just extend it out? I don't know what this is supposed to be, but it's a little area. I'm gonna put the tree out here. There you go. Now we have room for more dead relatives. <laughs> I don't know. I don't think there are any traps now. Yeah. Yeah. That that area is just just weird. There you go. I will save. And then there's only six hours, 45 minutes to go. But in this game, I was going to say that full speed actually is full speed and then they slow down. <laughs> See, it goes pretty fast now. This is three hours left, two hours left. One, well actually two, and there's the one hour mark, and he should be getting home right about now, in one minute. There he is. See, uh, and also, everyone that says, oh you can't have cars in The Sims 4 because it's not an open world. Yes, you can. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, I know you're very tired, but I'm going to end the stream so you can sleep. All right. <laughs> His days are going to be turned upside down. It, it's fine. It's fine. So, well, um, you will have a super duper time until next time. Stay safe and take care and stay tuned for a raid. And I'll see you all next time. Bye.